Well, search and rescue teams have been tirelessly working to find two missing boaters in Gloucester County, New Jersey. Their 19 foot boat capsized Saturday during rough weather. Only one of three people on board was rescued. Action News reporter Trish Hartman is live in West Deptford tonight. And Trish, we know today's search and rescue mission was suspended earlier this afternoon. That's right, Rick. The weather was really rough again today. State police have just identified the two victims that they have not been able to locate. Those are 24 year old Joseph McLaughlin and 26 year old Brian Palangi, both from Deptford. State police also said as of today, this is being considered a recovery effort. For a third day, search crews from state police, county, and local entities searched the Delaware River for two boaters who went missing Saturday afternoon. Officials say a distress call came in around 3 p.m. Saturday when a 19-foot recreational boat started taking on water in the area of Red Bank Battlefield Park in National Park. One of the boaters was saved by a good Samaritan near the Eagle Point Refinery on Saturday. He was treated and released, but two others now identified as 24-year-old Joseph McLaughlin and 26 year old Brian Palangi are still missing. Today, search and rescue boats navigated the choppy waters, launching from West Deptford as family members of the missing men from Deptford looked on. Smaller search and rescue boats had to be pulled back because of the rough conditions. Around 2 p.m., the search was suspended for the day. The wind is the biggest problem. We've been dealing with gusts this afternoon actually increasing at times over 35 miles per hour. So you have the gusty winds, you have a lot of choppy conditions on the water, which makes it difficult for anybody to be operating any kind of boat right now. And on top of all of it, it's a really cold day out there. The Delaware River's only in the 40s. The air temperature is only in the 40s. So officials are definitely up against a lot of challenges. Now it's unclear if the search will pick up again tomorrow. The cause of the boat capsizing is still under investigation, but officials did say over the weekend they suspect bad weather played a role. Reporting live in West Deptford, New Jersey, Trish Hartman, Channel 6 Action News. Shari. All right, Trish, thank you.